What's up with you guys? You know what time it is. It is time to get into another reaction video. I'm about to be reacting to the beautiful, talented, amazing singer So Yang singing I Will Always Love You, a Whitney Houston song. She's singing by a very legendary, talented woman that could never be replaced. I hope you guys enjoyed this. I do expect to enjoy this. Make sure you subscribe to my channel if you're new and you want to see more content released by me. Hit that thumbs up button if you want me to react to more of So Yang and share this video. I would really appreciate that. And if you got anything else that you would like to see me react to, just comment it below. I do read the comments. I will leave a link to the original video in the description below. Let's get into it. If I should stay, I would only be in the way. So I'll go, but I. of you every step of the way you guys i don't want to pause too much but i want to say this songs like this when i was younger this song you know whitney houston was not she's not of my generation but my mom my grandmother, my great grandmother, you know, even my uncles, my grandfather, you know, my dad, everyone loved Whitney Houston. And they would talk about her so much. Whitney Houston, oh my gosh, can't no one sing like her? Oh, you know, you know, some people want to compare other singers, you know. Like, oh, Mariah Carey ain't got nothing on Whitney Houston, you know, like stuff like that. And, um, you know, have little debates and stuff, but they loved Whitney Houston so much where they played it every single day in the car, within the house, you know, even would record moments of Whitney Houston being on 106 in Park just so they can go back and replay it, replay that music video and stuff like that. Because back then, you couldn't, you know, talk to the uh, the controller and, you know, tell it, I want to play this song and stuff like that. Like, we did, it, it was none of that during that time. I'm sure many of you guys watching, you already know that. So it was like, we had 106 in Park and you could record it so you could replay it. But other than that, you know, people weren't big on like YouTube, going to YouTube, searching up videos and stuff like that. Like it wasn't like a big thing, you know. So 106 and Pac recording that was like the moment of you listening to it or it being on the radio, you buying a CD, something like that, you know, and they would play it all the time. And it wasn't that I didn't think Whitney Houston can sing. Because I knew she could sing. And during that time, I was finding my voice what works for me because I myself am also a singer. So listening to her just really like blew me away. But it got to a point where I'm like, you know, I'm taking my hands. I'm little. I'm young. Putting it over my ears because I'm like, I'm listening to this every single day. Day, can we please play some Soldier Boy? You know, during that time, Soldier Boy was popping. Crank that Soldier Boy, you know, songs like that. Um, so I would like put my hands over my ears. You know, can you play some Bow Wow? Can you play some Soldier Boy? You know, something like that. 
But of course, them being older, I don't want to hear that hippity hoppity music. We want to hear actual music, you know, so I would be forced to listen to it. But it's just listening to someone sing a Whitney Houston song or just listening to Whitney Houston. It just brings back so many great memories because my great grandmother loved it. Whitney Houston, you know, and she's no longer here. Um, so it just bring back so many great memories, you guys. So the fact that I'm listening to So Yang, a woman that I support so much that I really love, sing by a legendary, amazing woman, Whitney Houston, this just already makes this great. We had some technical difficulties, but I think I fixed it. See, and some people probably would say just because she's adding her own little style and runs to it, some people will say she can't sing it like Whitney or something negative like she's done messed up an original song you know how some people are when someone sing a song by a certain artist that they really love and they're a big fan of where just because you add your own style to it they get upset and i feel like it's what you should do when you're singing a song by someone else you can never sing a song exactly like someone else because they made that song to fit them in their voice. So why not adjust it or add something to it that fits within you? And I think her runs and what she's adding to it actually sounds great. When I sing certain artists' songs like Omarion and you know, Chris Brown and so many other artists, Michael Jackson. I try to sing like me, not sing like them, because I'm not them, you know? But I think she's definitely, like, she's doing great. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Look at the guy in the back. I'm sorry, you guys. I don't know what's going on. Every now and then, it seems like the screen is, like, frozen. I can see it, but you guys can't. I don't know what's going on, you guys. It's something that I can't control. I don't know. It may be so. I don't know what it is. But, you know, um, hopefully you guys seen, like, the guy in the back. 
he was kind of like like wow like you can tell that's probably what he was saying in the back of his head because i was thinking the same thing you guys were probably thinking the same thing as well This is what I'm waiting for. And I will always love you. I will always love you. I will always love you. Oh man. You. Wow. Darling, I love you. I will always, I will always love you. Okay, I'm going to give that a nine and a half out of ten only because I wasn't there to witness that great moment. <laughs> but other than that, it would be a ten out of a ten, you guys. She did an incredible job singing this song. I think Whitney, if she was here, you know, she would definitely approve. This is something I'm definitely going to have to show my mother, my grandmother, you know, my uncle and them. Like, I'm going to have to show them this video because I think they would really enjoy listening to So Yang sing this. And they've never listened to So Yang before. Um, my uncle, he's clicked on my video. I have two uncles, but one of them have, you know, they haven't clicked on my videos. They don't know much about, like, YouTube and stuff like that. Like, you know, they're not all over social media like having an instagram or facebook and you know stuff like that like they're very like reserved they keep to themselves you know but i think he would really enjoy this you know he may end up you know wanting to listen to more of so yang by listening to this and you know like i said my family loves whitney houston they still to this day listen to Whitney Houston. You know, if we're having a gathering, something like that, you better expect they're gonna play some Whitney Houston. You know, um, I really enjoyed this. So Yang, she definitely did an amazing job and I hope you guys enjoyed this as much as I did. Subscribe to my channel if you're new and you wanna see more content released by me. It's one click of a button, it does not cost a thing. Hit that thumbs up button if you want me to react to more of So Yang. Share this video. I would really appreciate that. And if you got anything else that you would like to see me react to, just comment it below. I do read the comments. I hope you have a great day, night, whatever time that you're watching this video. Stay positive. Stay safe. Continue to pray and have faith each and every day. Keep your head up no matter what you're going through in life. I'm out, you guys. Peace.